Starting a new car company is tough. Big companies like VW are in charge, and it's hard to get noticed. But some newbies, like Tesla, have made a big impact with their ideas. Now, a new company called Zynga is trying to do the same thing. They started in 2019, but people are starting to take notice of them, which is good if they want to stick around. Zynga's first car, the 21C, is causing a stir. It broke track records at two famous racetracks in America, beating out cars from big companies like McLaren. Next, the car will tour Europe and probably beat more records. The 21C looks different from other cars, with sharp lines and curves that aren't just for show. These details help the car go faster by making it more aerodynamic. On the 15th of June, people in the UK got to see the Zynga 21C car for the first time. It was shown to the public at an event called Concourse on Savile Row. Elite Traveller got to talk to Lucas Zynga, one of the people who started the company, and ask him questions about the 21C car. However, there was something very special about the creation of this car. Want to know what it is? Well, keep watching. Zynga had so many new ideas that they registered 350 patents just during the design phase. Then, they redesigned the car and came up with another 100 patents. Lucas Zynga, one of the people who started the company, says, This car was made unlike any other. The chassis of the car is made using 3D printing and artificial intelligence, which is really new and cool. It's also made on a special new manufacturing system that makes the car work better. The 21C is the first hypercar made using 3D printing, which is pretty amazing and is changing things in the car world. Luca Zynga, one of the people who started the Zynga car company, says that the 21C car is going to change things a lot for people who love cars. He thinks it's just as big of a change as when Ford made assembly lines for cars a hundred years ago. This car is really different, from the way it's designed to the way it's made, and he thinks it's going to be important for people who collect or love cars. The 21C car has a really powerful engine that's actually in the back of the car, not the front. It's a hybrid engine, which means it uses electricity and gas to make the car go. The engine can make 1,250 horsepower, which is a lot. And it can go from 0 to 62 miles per hour in just 1.9 seconds, which is really fast. One reason it can go so fast is because it has an electric front axle that helps control how much power each wheel gets. This makes it easier to drive the car really fast, even in bad conditions. According to Lucas Zynga, the seating in the 21C is unique and different from other cars. It's the first street-legal car to have a 1 plus 1 seating arrangement. At first, it might seem like there's only one seat, but actually there's a seat right behind the driver for a passenger. This design makes the cockpit narrower and looks like something you'd see in a fighter jet. In addition to its cool appearance, the 1 plus 1 seating style of the 21C offers some significant advantages. Zynga has stated that it allowed them to make the windscreen smaller and add wider fender flares to increase downforce. This improves the car's aerodynamics, reducing drag and pressing it down onto the road for better grip in corners. These benefits give the 21C an advantage on the track and showcase its exceptional design and innovation compared to other major car manufacturers. But can the Zynga 21C beat the lap records of other well-known hypercars? Before we answer that, we want to hear from you. How do you feel about the evolution of 3D printing? How do you think it will change the world around us? Let us know in the comment section down below. Also, if you're enjoying this video, be sure to leave us a like and of course subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on any more awesome content like this. Let's get back to the video. The idea of having a car that performs well on the track while being road legal is not new, and many cars have been designed with this purpose in mind. The McLaren P1 and Senna, for example, are popular examples of such track-focused hypercars that have gained a lot of attention from car enthusiasts and collectors. However, despite their impressive performance, the lap records set by these established names were recently surpassed by the Zynga 21C. This is a significant achievement, because beating established lap records is not an easy feat. These records are benchmarks of performance and serve as proof of the manufacturer's engineering capabilities. For a relatively new company like Zynga, to break these records is an exceptional accomplishment, and it highlights the incredible design and innovation that went into creating the 21C. Zynga knows that not everyone has the opportunity to drive on a racetrack frequently. With that in mind, the goal was to create a car that could drive on both the track and scenic roads. 
The idea is to allow owners to take the car out to places like the Malibu Canyons or any other beautiful roads near them for an enjoyable driving experience. Meeting the safety and regulatory requirements for road legality is a critical step in the development of any vehicle. It involves a rigorous testing and certification process to ensure that the car is safe and compliant with all relevant regulations, such as emissions, safety, and noise standards. For the 21C to be considered road legal, Zynga had to ensure that the car met all the necessary safety and regulatory requirements. This included a range of tests and inspections, such as crash tests, emission testing, and noise level testing. These tests are conducted by independent organizations and regulatory bodies that are responsible for ensuring that cars are safe and compliant with regulations. It also opens up a wider market for the car, as it can now be legally driven on public roads, making it more accessible to a broader range of buyers. The Zynga 21C is not your typical car, designed with practicality in mind. This hypercar is built for speed and performance, with a focus on delivering an exhilarating driving experience. While it may not be able to accommodate things like luggage, groceries, or other bulky items, it more than makes up for it in terms of sheer power and handling. The Zynga 21C is expected to start production in Q1 2023. It's too early to predict the success of the car, but the company has already overcome many initial challenges. Zynga has proven itself against major rivals by breaking lap records, and they have more record attempts planned. This shows that Zynga is a small company that can compete with larger, established manufacturers. The story of Zynga versus the industry giants is ongoing, and it will be interesting to see how it develops in the future. Speaking of the future, what does the future hold for 3D printing and the automotive industry? 3D printing isn't going anywhere when it comes to car production. 3D printing is set to revolutionize the automotive industry by offering new opportunities for design and manufacturing. With the ability to create complex geometries and produce custom parts on demand, 3D printing has already been used in prototyping and low-volume production. But as the technology advances and becomes more cost-effective, 3D printing is expected to play an even larger role in car production. One of the most significant advantages of 3D printing is the ability to produce parts with high strength-to-weight ratios. This is achieved through the use of lightweight materials, such as carbon fiber reinforced polymers, also referred to as CFRPs, and titanium, which can be optimized for specific applications using generative design software. 3D printing can also reduce the number of parts needed in a vehicle, simplify assembly, and enable the creation of complex shapes that would be difficult or impossible to produce using traditional methods. In the near future, 3D printing is expected to become more integrated into the manufacturing process, with more components being produced using the technology. This will enable greater customization of vehicles, as well as faster and more effective production of replacement parts. It's also likely that 3D printing will be used to produce components for electric and autonomous vehicles, which have unique design requirements compared to traditional vehicles. In fact, several companies have expressed interest in 3D printing cars, including major automotive manufacturers such as BMW, Ford, and Audi. There have also been several startups that have emerged in recent years that are specifically focused on 3D printing technology to manufacture cars, aside from Zynga. There are companies like Local Motors and XEV. Even some luxury car manufacturers, such as Bugatti and Lamborghini, have experimented with 3D printing for certain car components. Before we know it, we may see nothing but 3D printed cars on the road. One of the biggest upsides to this change in production is the creation of new jobs. There will be a need for skilled workers to design and produce parts using this technology. This could include jobs such as 3D printing technicians, designers, and engineers who specialize in the use of this technology. You have to keep in mind that the adoption of 3D printing could lead to the creation of new businesses and startups that focus solely on providing 3D printing services to the automotive industry. All in all, the advance of 3D printing technology in the automotive industry is a great thing and we can't wait to see just how much more commonplace it becomes in the future.